America's newest research craft, the controversial XB-70, has pioneered in high-speed test missions. Two years ago, it was to go into production as the most up-to-date member in our arsenal of long-range bombers. Once Congress canceled the bomber program, NASA and the Air Force agreed to use the two prototypes jointly as test craft. Although because the XB-70 is expensive to build and operate, and has only limited payload capacity, it can never be used for commercial travel. Flying three times the speed of sound at 70,000 feet, about the same speed and altitude the SST will cruise at, this huge white bird now gathers invaluable data on stability and control characteristics. At the same time, cruise missions check out engineering solutions to the most difficult problem of high-speed flight, sustained heat. Hydraulic systems, electrical wiring, bearings, and seals have all been redesigned to withstand the scorching temperatures. Tests also gauge airframe strains and fatigue under these extraordinarily demanding flight conditions. As the only large experimental aircraft able to cruise at Mach 3, the XB-70 has a busy schedule, and much of the information gained on these flights will be directly applicable to the SST.